this happened in South Africa. This week, and nothing happened. If this should happen in Nigeria, so many people will be killed. So many people will be killed. Just watch it. And tell me that this kind of thing can happen in this country. We don't have democracy. A nation where they say we have democracy and you cannot express yourself. You see the government doing the wrong thing and you cannot say anything. Just watch it so that it will not be as if I'm talking too much. See. A political party was the one that organized this. The situation right now in Pretoria CBD, the situation right now in Pretoria CBD, the masses came out, the masses came out today. Thank you very much, comrades. I'm not here to do anything except to come and say on Monday a war has been declared against those who are against progress. On Monday the war has been declared against those who want to perpetuate the suffering and the struggles of the black majority of South Africa. I'm here to remind you that we've got an appointment with Monday. We have no money, we have no weapon, we don't have machine guns, we only have the bodies of African people to put on the picket lines. Whether they kill or they don't kill, we will be on the streets of South Africa on Monday. We don't care what the security cluster says, we don't care what the judge says. The economic freedom fighters proved once more who is in charge. 
in this country. When you said to business, is business as usual, open your shops, I said close. They closed. I mean church. I've got you by scrotum. There's nothing you can do, nothing. All of you combined. You can scream anyhow you want. Once more, I demonstrated to you black opposition, a white opposition with the ruling party combined. I'm in charge. And I want that to sink. You will tweet every day. You will call press conference every day. You will bring soldiers and police because the men in charge said it shut down South Africa and it was shut down. Whether you like it or not, in your cocoons, you are admitting that when the president speaks, that is a motion of no confidence, by the way. When the president speaks and says, open, I will protect you, they say, we can't trust you. They closed. Even this one of the tops ran around everywhere saying, open, open, I'll protect you. But uh, uh, when, uh, you never protect us any day. Why would you protect us today? They never listened to him. They closed. This one's ran to court and said, no, don't close. We have got an order, imaginary order. Cape Town, there won't be anything. Don't close. We're in charge here. Cape Town is ours. Cape Town is white. They can't do anything in the white area. They said to them, the business of Cape Town, we can't trust you. They closed because they knew who to trust.